Hi guys, in this video we're going to be looking at a Bad Mouth article titled Ex Exodus guitarist Rick Hun Hunnell Why Metallica chose to Kirk Hammett to replace Dave Mustaine And a link to the article will be in the description down below So to give you a summary um, This article is based upon a discussion between Rick Hunnell and Exodus frontman Steve Zetro Souza On Zetro's Toxic Vault YouTube channel and in the discussion, him and Ronald talk about the early days of Exodus and in and in question Kirk Hammett about why he was chosen to replace Dave Mustaine in the band Metallica. Now according to Rick, you he says that the reason you were going to see Metallica back in the day is because of Dave for his intoxicated antics and playing and his style of playing. Now, to take it a bit further, Rick says that the reason Metallica went ahead with their lineup decision slash lineup change is because of the personalities and style of guitar playing. Uh, according to Rick, um, James has this style of this bluesy, uh, bluesy but heavy approach to his song, to his guitar playing, and. Kirk Hammett just seems to be a good fit for it. Um, digging deeper into it as well, um, Rick Hunnell, Hunnell also says that Stain is the godfather of Fresh, and there's a strong case for that. Now, my strong case for Dave Mustaine being the godfather of Fresh. Hi guys, I hope you're enjoying the video. Just to let you know, if you want to see videos like this any other day, then make sure that you subscribe, and don't forget to drop a like. Also, also, you can also follow me on TikTok, where if you don't have enough time and you have a few minutes to spare, you can see what shorts I have over there. As well as Instagram, where that's where you get to see what my band merch collection looks like. And Twitter, where you get to see what songs I'm listening to on a daily basis. Now, on with the video. Is the influence he had on some other musicians, notably in the thrash metal scene. And... Another exhibit to this is Megadeth's early albums. I'm talking from Killing Is My Business all the way up until um, Rust in Peace. But you can, but I'm pretty sure some someone in the comments will come with other suggestions as well as to back up my claim as to why Dave Mustaine is the Godfather of Fresh. But also digging deep into the article. Um, Gary Holt also says that when it comes to him, when it comes to Kirk's time in Exodus, he says his ability slash talent was down to his memory about showing him everything necessary in terms of songwriting and guitar playing. There's even mentions to Metallica's songs such as um, Creeping Death and Child Under Ice and Gary Holt saying that um, bits of early Exodus or slash their demo songs bits of it can even be heard in those two songs and i think this is probably true when you listen to it very carefully when you listen to songs like um die by his hand and the impaler then listen to creeping death and child on the rice and these two two songs can be found on metallica's second album ride the lightning but yeah in summary from my perspective i think dave mustaine is the godfather of thrash other people may come with other suggestions, but I'll be interested to see what your suggestions are and your arguments for it. But do let me know what you think about all of this in the comments down below. Other than that, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.